want to give you an idea of what's going on with the damage in Naples now that the hurricane has passed and we have an opportunity the next day to get a look at some of the damage. A lot of palm fronds and stuff around. You can basically move the camera around here, take a look, uh, take a look as you want. Palm fronds down, you can see up above here, we've got some lights that are damaged, moved even. And that should be actually out over US 41. You can see how it's catacorner now. You can see the power poles across the way there that are down. That one there over there is split in half. And the 7-Eleven over there has got some damage as well. The power's been out here for a day. Show you even up the street. If you go turn it north there, across from the Goodyear, you can see that we have some, uh, the tops of the pole were snapped there. I'll come back here down uh, Palm, so that's US 41. Come down Palm and show you what it looks like down here. We got obviously a bunch of trees down here. This, by the way, if you see our set truck operations, that's our satellite truck that we're broadcasting with. We also have our, there's Trish, our producer, and then, uh, Mark and Beth are our camera and audio, which is right here. We're set up in the front of this neighborhood. A little bit of, a little bit of water left over, not much though. Uh, but look at the trees that are down here. You can spin the camera all around and take a look. You can see the big trees that are down here. I believe some live oaks and some uh, pine trees that are down. A little bit of standing water. Even look down. There's a uh, door here. I have no idea where that door came from. I suppose somewhere back to the northeast because that's where the winds were primarily from. I don't see much back there. A few people are back. We've got some car traffic out now. Uh, people trying to get through the neighborhood and you know see what's what. Now, this is down to one lane because of the tree that's down over the road. You can see this big pine that came down. Someone did come through with a chainsaw, by the way, and cut it. Look at the root ball on that thing, right? Someone did come through with a chainsaw, because you can see how the the uh, branches are cut here. So someone did come through and cut it. Apparently they didn't want to cut the whole thing down, though, and get both lanes open. So only one lane open here on Palm Street. Nice to see the sunshine out today. It's certainly hot, and no one has power. So, of course, you know what that means. That means there's no air conditioning. Temperature close to 90 degrees today. And just uncomfortable. Who knows how long power will be out. Uh, last check, it was filled today on Monday. It's about 7 million people across to Florida for that power. Uh, which is 7. That's there in, in Naples. Just thought I'd give you a 360-degree view of uh, what it looks like.